Would it even be moving day in Florida without rain? And I have to put all that away. The movers just left. Welcome back to another vlog. Today is moving day. So we are officially moving out of our apartment into a new one today. The movers should be here in about 20 minutes to grab our big items, like our couch, our bed, our mirror, coffee table, all that stuff. Christian and I moved all of our small stuff over the past like five days and yesterday we moved the last bit of it all so today is officially moving day and officially our last morning in the apartment the last time i'll probably be starting off videos like this but if you missed it i do have two other moving type vlogs on my channel i have a moving vlog part one and then i also have an empty apartment tour and I also have a packing vlog from last weekend where I started packing up all of our stuff. So if you're interested in those videos, I will link them down below. But yeah, today's moving day. I'm very excited and I'm also excited to bring you guys along in the process of settling into our new apartment and unpacking everything. I haven't unpacked a lot of this stuff over there. I have unpacked like glasses and a few like dishes and cooking stuff, but I haven't unpacked everything else. So I'm excited to bring you guys along on moving day. without rain <laughs> this is unreal just left here's the master we still have to put everything together but there's, there's just stuff everywhere we're obviously not done unpacking yet this is gonna be Christian's closet and then my closets in the other room so this is the extra bedroom this was the best way to put the bed with the desk right here we wanted to face it the other way and have the headboard on that wall so that way it wasn't blocking the window but it just wouldn't work with the desk right there and then here's my closet which i have to put everything away and then here is the extra bathroom where i'm gonna put a lot of my makeup and some stuff that i use to get ready in the morning for work i always get ready in our extra bathroom christian gets up after me for work 
so I don't have to wake him if I get up and get ready. So all the stuff is in here and I have to put all that away. And then here's our bedding that we have to put on the bed. There's trash, bar stools. We put the mirror right here. And now the place is not a home or it's not my home yet until the Nespresso machine is unpacked. So I'm gonna do that now and then fill that jar up with some pods. So I was thinking about putting the Nespresso machine in this corner because all of our mugs and everything are up here. So I think it would be best right here, plugged in there. So I think I'm gonna do that and unbox it. Forgot to show you outside but our couch fits perfectly in here. And then we put the chairs out here, and then the grill is right there. And then we put up the lights. They're gonna fog up because Florida. So the patio furniture out here, lights hung up. I don't know about the lights. I don't really like them hung up out here, if I'm being honest, so we'll see. And then I have to unpack all the glass dishes which will be going up here. I already did some of the plates, but I have to do the rest of it because everything else is in here. So I'm gonna unbox the espresso machine. And I already had this espresso machine. I just keep, or I kept the box and we kept some of the boxes to some of our appliances to make it easier to move. So I just kept the Nespresso box that I received the machine in so that way it's easier to move and it fits like I kept the sty styrofoam for it too so that way it fits and it's easy to move July and summer is in full swing. I'm gonna do like colorful summer boxes or pots, I guess. I do have the Master Origins collection. I do have more of those pods, but I just went through all of those for the first time because it came with a duplicates of each. So I filled the jar with one of each of the Master Origins. So now I'm gonna do this coffee, Giorno, Altesso, tropical coconut, and the rest of this tropical coconut in the bottom. And then we'll do Now, we are home.
Christian just helped me move the Alex drawer in here, which is basically my dresser. This light. I need to think, I think I need to put in a request to have it fixed. I don't know. Go like flicker. So I'm gonna put this up there. I think I'm gonna hang my shoes right here. See what I mean? The light just goes out. Deal with this light, it keeps flickering. It's so weird how Christian and I aren't sharing closets anymore. This light can you believe? Mm. Here we go, <laughs> it's back on. So I made a lot of progress on the bathrooms, basically put everything away and in its place, which is good. It might change or move around, I kind of just did it quickly because I'm very worn out from the past few days of moving and then today just moving officially. So I'm probably going to shower, I'm probably going to wash my hair and try and style it i'm just like so exhausted and i'm sore i'm gonna shower and i will talk to you guys later okay the only way i pulled off a full hair and makeup and outfit change was because i had a large iced coffee after a day of moving this would have not happened without a coffee we just both changed and we're gonna go to dinner with Christian and I's friend AP we're gonna go pick him up just crimped my hair for it because it's kind of rainy and gross outside which it has been for the past few days and this is just an easy hairstyle to wear in weather like that I put in a maintenance request for this light it is just so weird so I put in a maintenance request to get it changed because it will like turn on and then it will just shut off and then all of a sudden it will be on. No, oh, the lights do look good. It is so pretty. Okay, now it's not focusing. I give up. back to the apartment I dropped Christian off at our friend AP's house because he has a flat tire and Christian wants to go there and help him out which is literally right next to our old apartment which is where I'm standing and I wanted to come back by here and make sure that everything was clean and good to go and I wanted to come by here and just take a look at it one last time because this was Christian and I's first apartment together and I feel like everyone remembers their first apartment with their significant other. I'm like a sentimental person, so I definitely wanted to do just like one last walkthrough and stuff like that. 
It's so empty in here. Will I like shed a tear? I might. It's so crazy. Like look how small this room looks. How did we fit our bed in here? I feel like the rooms do look much smaller before you add everything, but why am I getting sappy over this? This was like a great first apartment for us, for sure, but I feel like we definitely like upgraded. The only thing that sucks about that new apartment is it is a little bit smaller. So we kind of lose this whole hallway and then that room is basically over there. And this living room is a little bit bigger than our other apartment, but we had the couch right here. So there was this whole bit of dead space behind the, the couch, but I'm just glad I came back to just take one last clip of it all. I'm gonna have one of these. My tan is coming off so bad on my hand. <laughs> it looks so bad. Every time I reach for something in a video clip, I'm like, mm, better not show my hand. Oh my God, that's so embarrassing. And I was wearing my Apple Watch. And it's just, whatever. It was rubbing off. We just did a huge, well not a huge, huge, but a grocery restock. And then we'll probably go to Trader Joe's and Costco next weekend. We just got some stuff for dinner and Spindrift, the raspberry lime. Well, all the flavors that Publix had were buy one, get one free. They probably won't still be buy one, get one free by the time you guys see this, but so I got two raspberry lime because that's my favorite flavor so we're gonna put all this stuff away and then we'll figure out dinner okay I just got home I picked up sushi for dinner we picked it up from kabuki and we got spicy tuna rolls and then this is the buki buki roll which is shrimp tempura to take a bath but I wanted to end off this moving vlog number two I hope you guys enjoyed this mini moving series that I did on my YouTube channel I will see you guys when I pick up the camera next weekend I hope you guys enjoyed this video make sure you're subscribed so you don't miss any future content give this video a thumbs up and I will see you in my next video Bye.